Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So this video is regarding UPSC Geoscientist exam. So the official uh, like notification is there for admit card. So now you can download your admit cards or e-admit card basically for the exam and you can print it up so that you can bring it for the exam, right? And you can also look upon that which center you have been allotted. So this is the page. This is the page from where you can download it. I will give you a link to come up to this page. Uh, the link will be there in the description of this video. You can directly click on that link and we'll be seeing this particular page which you are seeing right now, right? Now, in order to download your admit card, you can do that either by your registration ID or by your roll number. Now, uh, you uh, like in order to get your registration ID or roll number, if you have not written it somewhere, in that case, please check your registered email. Just search for UPSC. Uh, in the Google search bar or in the email of yours, you will find out the mails which you might have got while successfully submission of the form, right? And there you will be having both this registration ID and roll number both will be there. So you can log in using both any of these, all right? In case if you have forgot your RID, that means registration ID, you can click here and you can go through the procedure to get your registration ID back. But since I know mine, so I'll directly show you that how you can basically download. So I'll use by registration ID, you can either use by roll number also process is totally same so nothing different over there i'll quickly do it for myself and then i will show you that how the page looks like or what happens in the next step so you have to fill your registration id you have to fill your date of birth and you have to uh, give this captcha code once you have filled this you have to submit and then you will be able to download your admit card so i have filled it for myself let me just click, quickly click on this submit button so once you submit, you will be able to download your admit card. This is going to look like this. This is just a PDF which is going to get downloaded just after filling the form, right? Now you can take a print of it by clicking over here and uh, just save it in a PDF format. So if I click here, I can save it in the PDF format. Before going into that, what your admit card says, let's look upon that. Your admit card contains your name, your roll number, your photo ID, identity card, whatever identity you have used while filling the form. If you have used Aadhaar card, PAN card, whatever you have used will be mentioned over here. Then your father's name, mother's name, your category of the exam for which you are applying and then the center of the exam and then the venue of the exam. Okay, so these things will be here. Uh, if you scroll down to the next part of it, so it contains the timetable that means at what time which exam is going to be. So if you have filled for the chemistry subject, so your general studies will be from 9.30 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. And the chemistry paper will be from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. All right. So this is what they have mentioned as the time. And then there are some basic instructions like bring this e-admit card print out along with the original photo ID card as mentioned above uh, to secure the admission in the, uh, in, the admin, in the examination hall. So basically whatever identity card you have filled while filling the form, that identity card should be original and this particular admit card should be in the print out form. All right. Now, e-admit card must be preserved till the declaration of the final result. That's what they are suggesting you. Candidates are advised to carefully read the important instruction of the candidate. Uh, that will be there in the third page of this particular uh, PDF. Candidate should strictly follow the instruction of the commission and that's all. This is the first page of your admit card. Now, if you come down, second page contains your uh, informations like important instructions in Hindi. And the third page contains important instructions in English. So you can read about it. All these are basic instructions like uh, uh, what is your like what are the conditions in which your exam might get cancelled? What are the things which you have to do while bringing uh, while coming for the exam and all? So just basic instructions are here, and this is how your whole uh, admit card and this is going to look like. All right. So if you have filled the form, please did please download your admit card check out your venue, check out your examination center and be prepared for the exam. After gate, this is going to be the second most important exam for you. All right. So that's it from my side for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Till then, have a great day. Bye bye. Take care. Hey guys. So I teach live on Unacademy Plus platform. Here I teach for the CSIR UGC net category and you can follow me over here for regular classes. You can access my free classes as well as my paid classes on this particular platform the classes which are free you can get that under the section of special classes whereas in order to access my paid classes paid live classes we have to take an academy plus subscription so do make sure that you take the an academy plus subscription to access all my paid classes which are quite organized the whole syllabus is being completed over there and the classes are quite regular over there 
So make sure that you take an Academy Plus subscription by using my referral code that is N underscore Huda. That's it for this. Thank you so much.